So, um, I don't know how long it's going to stay recording. I just ain't got no space. I had to pray on the nasal line tonight. I got quite emotional. Um, when I started praying for Tracy, it's just like, I don't know, it's just like, it's really, it's over, no, I can't use the word overwhelming. I don't know, it's like grieving. I don't know how to explain it. Let me see if I can. It's like my um, spirit is like grieving for him because I'm hurting because, let me put it like this. Okay. I am upset with myself because I thought he heard me. He said, because, like, continue. I'm upset with myself because, you know, the Lord warned me when mommy was alive. And who knows? Maybe that's the reason why. Or maybe some of the reason why God, mom, why God took all of them out. Because... I would be calling mommy, frustrated, worried. I can't even see him. Worry, always calling her, maybe calling Gaga. Mom would have been like, she would have been too old for me to be calling her. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't have stepped out with that. But, um, Gaga. Maybe I would have called God. But anyway, my point is, is that I um, am like feeling guilty because I didn't listen, you know? And now I'm in this predicament. And the reason why I'm staying in the predicament, it's not even about his soul anymore. Because you know how you get to a point, I'll just say his soul is lost, you know? Good. Hi, thank you. Hi, Boo Boo. I'm good, how are you? That's good, yeah? I'm good, thank you. Let me get a grilled chicken wrap. Grilled chicken wrap? Yeah. You have avocado? No, I don't think I have. Oh, it's finished? No, it's All right, never mind. I want an avocado. Never mind. Let me get let me get two slices of carrot cake, please.
You got a wrap, right? Yeah. No, no, no. I didn't get no wrap. That's it. That's it. Oh, okay. Yeah, I did get. You know. Okay. No avocado. <laughs> Thank you. Let's see. Maybe I can go on that. Um, we can go on the site. So yeah, so so I, I don't I feel kinda like bad. I really think it's a punishment to me. I really think Tracy gonna outlive me because of my punishment, you know. You know, I it, it seems you know, I'm just going to be honest. This is so true. I know God answers my prayers. I know I pray. I say things and God answers. But I don't know this particular prayer. It took me 30 years. And here's on. 30 years I was praying that me and Tracy get together. Right? <laughs> and God answered that prayer. Brought us back together. I was so happy. But maybe it wasn't. God's prayer answer. Maybe it was my answer. You know? And Pastor Glover Norman was saying, oh, he just want to come because he's sick and they want to get on you for you to take care of him. But it was nothing I could do. I might as well have brought him in and took care of him. You know? Who knows? Maybe it's the prayers that I'm praying that's keeping him alive. And just hypothetically speaking, if he hadn't been out there, maybe he would have been gone already. Um, not wishing that, but I'm just looking at all scenarios and bringing to the conclusion that all these things is happening and all the things that I'm talking about. Now he's down to a point where I got to take care of his daughter's there. You know, I'm going to have a talk with, with Mary. I know my feelings on the situation. Is she going to do what she wants? Okay, let me see. I think it was. Okay. So I got to eat some here. So let me see if it was. I know I got a glove on. Let me see if it's a glove on. Because maybe I can get that. Because I'm done to get that chicken. Sandwich of it, because that was good. Dad, I can never seem to get them. Maybe I should pre order. Tuesday, the 25th. I don't want it that early. I want it well. I want it well. On 13. It's a good lunch time. I should have went and bought the avocado and put it in. Oh, and get that. Oh, and get that. That's me?
right, that's it. Huh? Thank you. Thank you. So, um, yeah, so I'm like, you know, it's now I'm at this stage where I'm ready to give up. Not on God, but on Tracy. I'm ready to give up on him. I'm at a stage now that, you know, I'm putting him in the home, put him wherever, send him back home. You know, I don't know. At one time, I was afraid for him to leave, not because of his money. And I want to be honest with my spirit that I wasn't afraid of him leaving based on the money. And that I didn't want to hold on to him based on his money. No, it was all about his soul. I did not want to, because, you know, I didn't want him to leave, go back to California. And I didn't do that. I felt like a failure. You know, and I'd be like, oh my God. I couldn't even bring nobody in. My husband of all people, my kids of all I'm failing. It's a failure. So every time he would say he was leaving, he was leaving. Ooh, that would put my heart. I think it was more so because I was so stuck on the fact of having a husband. Felt one to separate and now I failed again. You know? Oh man. So let me sit here and chat a bit. Okay, so I got to work on my phone, so I got to. Hey, I ain't getting on 12, 11 o'clock, I missed, I think, two days. I'm 
different. For some reason, my mouth looked better. I think the, they clean my teeth and rest, so, so I'm make sure I don't get them like yellow like they were. I think they gave me new teeth. They don't look that big. Nah, to you when I smell. See? It's not that big. The gums, I think they, the other one probably trim. I think he trimmed down the gums. Because it was like, I had a lot of gum up here. Okay. Ain't that much gum? I don't know. I really think that my gums healed. And all that feeling that I was having when I was going like this, I think that was in the gums. I remember one time I used to get pains. And I was like, what is that? What's going on? It took me a while, but the Lord let me know. I was like, that's your gums. Your gums is healing. So I really think I'm going to go out what that lady said. I'm going to wait for two months or three months, however long he said I can wait. I'm going to ask him and say, can I wait a while before I come for the next one? Because I'm just, I know you don't want to wait till it's not even me. So. Tastes real good cold. Let me see what's in here. Okay, so I'm gonna put this in the fridge. Yeah, I'm gonna give him a juice. Yes, I'm going to give him my own shoes. I'm going to drink this. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Hey, hey, yeah. Yeah, right? It's just natural. I could just... I can wear it any way I want to wear it. That's a good thing. I like that. Thank you. 
I was gonna say, where that little tiny room come from? I think if I put it on the pot, that's a lot of glue. Yeah, we can take glue out. Is that my hair? Oh, yeah, that is my hair. Mm. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, this one. That's not the sleeve ain't all the way down there. Don't have to go, just go right here. She's pulling it all the way down there. That's not my name. I gotta get that over. 